Let's have a look at this database. Oh, I don't have to type in a number. I click here, and there's a down arrow, and I select a number. That's very nice. This would be very nice if, when I had long text to type in, I didn't have to type it in. There was a selection for me to choose from. I can do that. Let me go into, let me just save and go into design view. And I'm going to do something with sport. Under sport, I'm going to go to look up wizard. Watch. This dialog box appears. I want the look up wizard to get the values for another table. No, thank you. I will type in the values I want. That's correct. Now, I want to add the words hockey or rugby or tennis. Next. Finish. Save. If I have to add information, I would start to type there. I didn't have to type, I would just click and this drop down box would appear and I can choose one of these. Click in there and I can choose. This is useful when you have to enter information. There it is, you can choose. I like to arrange these in alphabetical order, so I show no um, preference one for the other. If you've made the box and you want to add something more, you can do it. Design view. I'm in sport. I'm going to look up. And there they all are. The sports are inside inverted commas and there's a dot comma in between each. I'm going to add one more sport and I'm going to add it in the middle. I'm going to add swimming. It's not spelled correctly, I know that. Let's have a look. I'm going to save There. It's not spelled correctly. There it is. To go back and fix it would be the same way. Two M's. Yes. So if you were going to add we are. 